Before I introduce you to the next rhythm, I would like to talk to you about the sound you will hear from the drum. You will hear dum and tak and ka. Now let me show you. Dum is the deep sound. Tak is the high pitch tone from your right hand. Ka is the high pitch tone from your left hand. The first rhythm you will hear in our drum solo choreography, the very famous Saidi. Saidi is 4-4 four, four tempo, means four count per measure. It is pronounced dum tak taka dum dum taka tak taka dum tak taka dum dum taka tak taka. Let me show you. that we're going to learn with the Saidi rhythm is the hip drop. Let's begin with our feet about hip distance apart, bending the knees, keeping the pelvis tilted forward, and lifting the rib cage. We're going to lift the hip up into the rib cage and release as if you were going to sit into a chair. Lift, release, lift, release, lift, and release. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's try the other side. Remember to lift the hip directly up into the rib cage and release into a sitting position. You're dropping the hip. Lift and drop. Lift, drop, lift, drop, lift, and drop. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now let's try another variation of the hip drop. We're going to add a kick for every two counts. We're going to start with a lift. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You want to make sure that you're not forcing the foot out. It's just a small kick and you're pointing the toe when you kick out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's try the other side. Lift, drop, lift, kick. Lift, drop, lift, kick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now let's try a third variation of the hip drop. When we hear the Saidi rhythm, you hear doom tek, doom doom tek, doom tek, doom doom tek. We're going to move our hips to those accents. Down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up. Doom tek, doom doom tek, doom tek, Doom, doom, tech. Let's try the other side. Down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up. Doom, tech, doom, doom, tech, doom, tech, doom, doom, tech. Let's try that with the music.
move that we're going to learn with the Saidi rhythm are the piston hips. Stand with your feet hip distance apart. The knees are slightly bent. The pelvis is tucked. And remember to always lift the rib cage. We're going to press one hip down into the ground as the other one rises and change. Change and change. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's try that with a sharp movement. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now let's try this with some level changes. We're going to go down for five counts. One, two, three, four, five, drop six, come up seven, eight with some shoulder shimmies. Shoulder shimmies, you're just moving the shoulders back and forth. Only the shoulders. Now there's a key to going down. We got to keep the knees close together as we're going down and as we're coming up. And make sure that your back is straight. Let's try this together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's try this with the music. The next step that we're going to learn with the Saidi rhythm is the four point locks. We're going to begin with our feet hip distance apart, bending the knees, and remember to always keep the pelvis tilted forward and the rib cage lifted. We're going to bump our hips to the side, one, release to the back, two, as if you were going to sit, to the other side, three, and forward, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Four is a tuck. You want to make sure that you're pulling in from the lower belly. Tucking in and release. Tuck and release. Let's try that again. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Four. Remember, the tuck is a sharp movement. Tuck. Let's try that with the music. 